CIB Institute, in cooperation with the European Commission, organized on the 3rd of December in Luxembourg an Investors Fair unlike any other. An Investors Fair entirely dedicated to social innovation. We're talking about the change makers. We're here to celebrate the people that are using the power of entrepreneurship to tackle societal issues. That is what social entrepreneurship is. We're delighted to have you all here to celebrate you, to learn about your projects and what it is you're trying to do. In this room, we have philanthropists, venture philanthropists, social investors, investors, supporters, a little bit of everything. The EIB Institute had specially selected for this event 12 outstanding projects. 12 projects chosen among the finalists of the EIB Institute Social Innovation Tournament and the Social Innovation Competition, organized by the European Commission. 12 truly innovative ideas in need of investments to reach their full potential. What could democracy be like 20 years from now? Politia is a platform for political innovation. We develop the networks, the tools and the experiences that unleash collective intelligence and reconnect citizens with political decision making. What these people need when they, when they come to us, obviously food, Shelter, that is, that is the first thing. But then we need to give them information, tools, tools for integration. I think it's important first and foremost to uh, see uh, that, the, that the European Investment Bank Institute are taking the lead in these kind of questions. Uh, we need to collaborate, we need to come here and we need to see that a lot of people can do a lot of things together. For me today, Everything is about social entrepreneurship because it is about bringing access, democracy and freedom of choice, etc. to everyone. I think that all entrepreneurs today in Europe are actually engaged in social um, entrepreneurship. Uh, I think that, you know, the time of the, the um, big win or, or not having a social uh, part to your uh, business proposition is quite frankly over. I mean everybody realizes that they have to be sustainable, they have to do something that will bring value to the society and to our world. Speaking in front of an audience composed of investors and business angels was certainly not an easy task, but driven by their belief in their projects and sheer enthusiasm, the 12 entrepreneurs did their best to defend their ideas. This is really great that uh, we are being honored to, to share our ideas and thoughts. It's such a great crowd. I was really pleased to see so many people being interested and the organization is just wonderful. So we need to talk to those people who are sitting here, who have an overview of the business and able to support us in many ways, both with financial means and also with their connections. It's a great place to present our project. It's a hotel run by refugees and we need people who take up this idea, who bring this idea to Luxembourg, to Brussels, to Barcelona, because I think Magda's Hotel is needed everywhere to integrate refugees in our workplace. The event of today was great for us. It's very important to have the opportunity to get in touch with real investors, with people that uh, knows about social entrepreneurship and can give, give us not just the money that we need to start up our uh, uh, projects and our dreams, but also their knowledge and their mentors, mentoring. So uh, I'm very excited to be here and I really hope that I can uh, get very good advice and uh, maybe new partnerships and uh, uh, good help from these amazing people. I think they are very promising uh, cases um, that they have developed very interesting models, uh, did very uh, good proof of concept, but uh, I think we also see, and that is probably um, characteristic for the status of the industry in Europe, that the, uh, most of them are still at early stages, so they uh, need, I think, both financial support but also non-financial support in uh, developing their business models and really uh, develop the capabilities to successfully scale up. 